What's up guys? In this tutorial, I will show you how to prevent weathering waves from crashing on your iOS or Android device. First, let's adjust your weathering waves in game settings. Open up the game and head over to your settings before the game crashes. Tap on the gear icon on the bottom right and then head over to the graphics settings section. Here, lower the graphics preset to low or medium if you notice any lag or stuttering while in-game. This can already fix seemingly random crashes with withering waves on your mobile device. The same goes for the in-game resolution. Lower this option a bit if you can. Set the frame rate to 30 frames per second and lower some of the other options too, such as the shadow quality and special effects quality settings. When this is done, close the game settings and then force close the game as well as all other applications running in the background. This should clear up your memory. I'll show the next steps on an iOS device, but you can follow along on an Android device. Open up your settings app and here, scroll down to access your battery settings. Make sure to disable low power mode. If your device is low on battery, then plug it in, as low power mode can sometimes lower the performance you can get on your device to preserve battery life. Next, head to your general settings to access your storage settings. This might take a moment to load your storage information. And then, you can preview if you have enough storage left to allow the game to download and install updates and other files. Games like Wuthering Waves don't use up too much storage when downloaded through the App Store, but their file size will go up the longer you play the game. In my case, it's over 10 GB. If you notice that you have less than 5 GB left, then consider deleting some unused apps or movies from your device to free up space. Next. Make sure you're running the latest software update on your device. For iOS devices, head back to your general settings and tap on Software Update. Here, download and install the latest update before restarting your device. Restarting will not only install the update, but also make sure that all processes get a refresh, which can help fix the crash problem you're experiencing. Lastly, make sure Wuthering Waves is up to date. Open up your Google Play or App Store and look up Weathering Waves. Here, download the latest update in case there's one available to you. I hope this helped you out. Leave a comment if you have any questions and see you in the next one.